Hey guys, welcome back to the next episode of the Legend of <laughs> the Saint and the Legend of Zelda. <laughs> My first, uh, this is the first time I've done that, and this is episode three. Um, welcome back to Super Mario Odyssey. In the last episode, we completed half of the Sand Kingdom here, collecting a whole bunch of power moons and encountering these Moe Eye creatures that are basically like the lens of truth. Oops. Uh, the lens of truth. Okay. So, I'm just gonna leave him there stunned. But now we're gonna be progressing on to the next part where. Um, it's the Bowser Cruiser! Oh my gosh, I'm recording these episodes in succession. I can't believe I forgot it was the Bowser Cruiser. Um, I could go out this way, but there's, like, literally a ton to see out here. So, I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do a third episode of Toaster Reina Kingdom, showing off a whole bunch of power moons and stuff that we can collect. Things are heating up at the inverted pyramid. They must be trying to steal a legendary binding band. Yeah. Okay. That sign tells you how to roll, which is basically this. Shit, you can either you can either duck, um Oh gosh. Well, now I got more spikes in my nose. You can either duck and press Y, or you can duck and shake the goi joy cons. Goi wanna okay. Huh. <laughs> um before we go into the pyramid, though, we can see that we got a couple of power moons in there. A mul or a multi-moon that we can't get to. Yeah, we won't be able to get that for a little bit. But over here, we got a guy with his taxi stuck in a block of ice. <laughs> we talked to him, he says... I've got a customer waiting, but from the looks of this, th from the looks of this mess, I'm not going anywhere anytime soon. Burr. Okay. Yeah, there's nothing we can really do to help him right now. But, oh, that poor sheep! <laughs> We're gonna be doing something with the sheep here in a minute. Um, let me show you where it is first. But I think it's over the hill. Oh, it's right there. Okay, so you're gonna wanna take, <laughs> just smack the sheep in, a, in the butt. And you're gonna wanna corral them into the center area right here. We get a little jingle when we put them in. No, 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 my beautiful sheep. The three of them have escaped and now I'll never get them back. N never is a pretty strong word, buddy. You'll get them back. I'll bring them back to you. Okay. So, where'd he go? There he is. This guy over here. And I think the other one is not far up the rise. Wee. And you can just smack him in the butt. <laughs> ha, I was playing this game with my sister the other day in the two-player mode. Um, and we accidentally smacked one of the sheep off the cliff. And we just died because we thought that sheep was gone forever. Um, I didn't get the sheep in there. There we go. Okay, I think the last one is up the hill over here. Over here, I think. Where'd he go? Or was that the one that I just got? Okay, come on. Oh, that hawk there has a um has a thing too. Where is this last sheep? Is he up over the hill over here? I could probably do the Sphinx one. See, that portrait is empty. What the heck? I was watching a Let's Play um, of this game that somebody did, and they this portrait was already filled with uh, New Donk City, but there's nothing here. So I don't understand what uh, what unlocks it. By the time I finished the kingdom, the portrait was unlocked, but like for the Let's Play I was watching, the guy hadn't um, finished the kingdom yet, and it was there. That's the biggest tourist attraction in all Tostarena, the Inverted Pyramid. We keep a famous artifact in there, a treasure that binds two people together even if their world's upside down. We call it the Binding Band. Pretty fitting name, right? Oh, I didn't collect these coins when I was playing them, playing it before. What the heck, Mario? Okay. 
Oh, that's cute. The, <laughs> the lizard lays himself flat. Kind of protect himself from the heat. Okay. I think that was what my sister was telling me about before, that there was a slanted pillar that you could walk up. Um, but anyway, I think I'm going to worry about that other sheep later. Yeah, I've wasted a lot of time trying to find this sheep. Anyway. I saw a weird couple going to the pyramid. I think they're going to see our celebrated binding band. Alright, well let's go up and into the pyramid. The, into the inverted pyramid. And of course, because it's inverted, we're going to have some gravity stuff going on. Um, kind of like in, um, in, in, uh, Galaxy. What is this? Is there anything out here? Oh, just some coins. Okay. I hadn't gone out there on my pre- on my playthrough. But anyway, um, just some coins. Coins are useful though. I mean, I got 500 already, so I don't, don't think I'm going to be dying anytime soon. Or getting a game over, rather. Kind of like in Four Swords Adventures, where I had so many fairies, there was like literally no chance of um, getting a game over. I don't think I've ever seen a game over in that game. Anyway, there was a level just kind of, kind of just like this in Mario Galaxy. Uh, oh gosh, that was close. Okay, here we go. We made it. Oh, I missed all those coins. Alright, whatever. I have plenty of coins. I don't have enough coins to buy those boxers, but... Because the boxers are a thousand coins. I mean, I'm halfway there, but... Oh, gosh, really? I'm gonna have another heart before I go to the boss battle, but... There we go. Oh my gosh, are you serious? The beeping sound does go away. Okay, come on. There we go. Oh my gosh, really? I like how they got the jingle in there. I, I hadn't died while in 8-bit form. Um, but anyway. Oh gosh. I'll just leave them alone. Leave the Goombas to live another day. Oh, okay. Okay, there we go. Okay. Oh, wait. I forgot about this. There's a secret area with a ton of coins. Oh, I can, that's what I'm hearing is Bowser's airship. Okay. We also got a power moon back here. Yay! Secret of the inverted mural. I wish I could do, like, jumps and stuff. I mean, you can walk faster, I guess. And I mean, I suppose you could walk faster in the ori- Oh, gosh. In the original, um... Okay, well, anyway. I don't know how to get up there because there's some Tostarena coins up there. Oh gosh! I forgot that the bullet bills still come after you. Okay. Let's just blow our way through the wall. Okay. And then let's capture this bullet bill. And break this rock over here. Oh! Well, that works. We got a six heart thing. Okay, we need to bring one of the bullet bills through. Let's break that block, just for good measure. There we go. Couldn't see him, but I figured as long as I could home on him, I, I'd have a chance. Alright, let's go this way. Okay, that works. I wasn't sure if that would work. You press ZL to drop faster. I don't think there's anything except coins in those. Yeah, pretty much. Alright. Alright, here we are. Up here for the boss battle. This boss battle's pretty darn easy too. But, um... Yeah, I don't think there's anything else we can do up here right now. But let's, let's go fight. Take on... 
The Brutals again. Bowser's flying off in the Bowser Cruiser. Looking for the Binding Man Chumps? Too bad. The boss has it now. And you guys ain't invited to the wedding. Well, here we go. Okay. I don't know if these Brutals have individual names or whatnot. They're just called the Brutals. And this is a Brutal. They should have individual names. There we go. And now our head is unprotected. Oh! Oh! I didn't know you could do that! Okay! I guess that works. Interesting. I think those ones you have to hit back at her just right, but... Either way. Alright, but this you can just hit in any old direction and it'll still hit her. Alright, I'm gonna let her do this, because... For the first one, she kinda drew, like, a hexagon pattern, like the... Like this arena. Kinda shaped like this arena. But, uh, for this one, she does a star. So... Alright, we're gonna let her throw our bombs. And then we're gonna do the big one. And then hit it. There we go. And you can stun her with a hat if she starts running away. Alright. Um, we've taken on and completed that boss fight. But we still got one more boss fight before we end off this episode. Yay! Woohoo! Why am I even trying to sing? It's not gonna work. Showdown on the inverted pyramid. Yay! Now it's just gonna fly us all the way back to the beginning of the Odyssey because time is gonna change. Yay! The inverted pyramid is gonna fly up into the sky. The hole in the desert. Excuse me, I'm a little tired. Okay. That brutal slowed us down a bit, but we're still racking up power moons. How odd. The inverted pyramid is floating, and it's gotten so much colder. Is this more of that Bowser's doing? I say he's- he does make- I say he does make trouble, doesn't he? Alright. Okay. I kinda wanna collect a couple more power moons that I missed. But, um... Oh, we can ride the Jaxi now if we want. Um, but... There's, like... Um, they- they kinda want you to ride the Jaxi because of these guys that pop up. Yeah. Uh. Okay, there we go. And you can't kill them, I don't think. So, you kind of just want to leave them be. Oh, gosh. Uh, I had my eye on the thing. Okay. I'm going to see if I can get this guy. There's a Lakitu frozen in the ice. There we go. Got the power moon. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Got it. Okay. Bird traveling the desert. So there's two birds in the desert. There's that one. There you go. The controllers were vibrating and they knew that one was there anywhere. Where the birds gather. So we got two power moons right there in, the su in quick succession. Um, this is a sign that will tell you about the cap jump. So basically if you throw out the cap and then run into it, you can get a pretty, pretty high jump. If I can do this right, I can enter that- I can enter that coin ring. There we go. Enter the coin ring and not take damage on the cactus. Um, we could go do that one, I guess. Since we're here. Oh gosh, climb the tree. Oh, it's over there. That was the wrong tree. Okay. This reminds me a lot of sunshine. Jumping around on the palm trees and such. Oh gosh, there we go. Huh. 
Okay. There's a couple of power moons that I've gotten that are really difficult to collect, and those are usually timed challenges, kind of like that one. Um, but, yeah, it takes a little bit to get, um, get the hang of the time challenges. One of them was over here by this poison lake over here, which I actually haven't gone to yet. Oh yeah, and there's this one right here. There's a green, ca uh, there's a cactus with a green knob on it. You can actually possess this cactus, which is really weird. But and then you can just ground pound the space where the cactus was and get a power moon. Wandering cactus. I now have plenty of power moons to power the ship and get out of here. But okay. Um, so there's a secret thing under there that kind of reminds me of the blooper minigame from, uh, or I don't know if you could call it a minigame, but the blooper game from, um, oh gosh, I jumped a little bit too early. <laughs> Alright, I don't think I'm going to worry about those coins because it's just going to take time to get back there. Uh, maybe not. But there's a couple of Tusterina coins under there that we can't get. It's really pretty, pretty cold. <laughs> Oh, okay. Oh, come on. Let's waste more time. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna worry about those Toasterina coins later. That's just gonna take time to set up the jump and stuff like that. Oh, yeah, to get, um, to get that power moon up there, um, I kind of took a, a leap of faith from the top of the pyramid. Is that portrait? The Piltrip portrait is filled. Wow. So I can go to New Donk City right now if I wanted, but I'm not going to. Because I don't know exactly what it would do. I feel like it would break, um, break uh, continuity, but it shouldn't because they gave it to you. But anyway, I think there's something down there, but I'm not brave enough to jump in. What do you think, Mario? Are we brave enough to jump in? I don't want to collect those sheep, but it's going to take too much time. And we got a bunch of puzzles that we need to do down here, so let's just go down here. Whee! <laughs> it's okay, Cappy. We're going to live. We're going to live because the game says we're going to live. Anyway, so let's go down here. Um. <laughs> Ice physics. Everybody hates ice physics. There we go. Okay. Oh. thought there was a Goomba there. Anyway. We're gonna open this up and get a couple more Toasterina coins. Okay. I don't know where all the Toasterina coins are. But I have collected a few more than I didn't in my other playthrough. Um, so those coins look very tempting, but don't get them. But, now that we've possessed a Goomba, we won't slip on the ice. Which is actually pretty darn useful. Okay. So, I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna let go of this Goomba, go over here and possess this stack, and then go jump on this Goomba. Got it? Okay. And there's another couple Goombas up here. We're gonna wanna... Oh, no, 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 no! Oh, I didn't wanna do that. Okay. I hope I still have enough... Oh, there's a couple more Goombas, actually. I guess they spawned because I killed a couple of them. Ah, get up! Okay. Oh, I'll get my health back once I collect this Power Moon. There we go. Whew! Goomba Tower Assembly. Okay. All right, let's go across. The, now that I think about it, because I don't know how to get some of these uh, power moons, some of um, some of these episodes might start to get really long. Um, so I hope you guys are okay with that when we get into the other parts of the game that I actually don't know yet. So the episodes are probably gonna get longer and such. But, I hope that's okay. 
As long as I have time for them. Um, so there's a power moon up there. Up, um, I'll, I'll probably put like a circle or an arrow on screen to show whereabouts it is. But um, <laughs> I actually can't get it yet. I, I don't know how to get it. So, I'll probably have to figure out how to do that on my own time, and then I'll come back and get it, I guess. I didn't want to do that! No! Uh, I wanted to press the Y button. Okay. You don't want the bullet bill to hit the, the Super Mario Galaxy thing, because... Because then you'll have to deal with a, a thing. So, what I wanted to do was press the Y button. There's no reason to break the ice, but uh, I guess I just do it anyway. So, what I wanted to do was press this. I suppose you can shake the Joy Cons to do more, I guess. But it doesn't matter. Alright, let's go down here. I gotta end off this episode pretty soon, but we're gonna do a boss fight first. Okay, come here. There we go. Okay, let's fly across. So I actually haven't made mention of it yet, but when you um, want to possess something that's already wearing a hat, you gotta um, you gotta knock the hat off first, and then. Um, I mean, I've shown it off multiple times already, but you gotta knock the hat off before you can throw Cappy onto it to, put, to capture it. Wear ring. I don't know. I don't have it. You take ring? No, no, I didn't take it. That was Bowser. Okay. Um. Okay. So what you're gonna want to do is make him hit the patches of ice, because then we'll be like, oh, my hand. And then you're gonna want to capture his hand. And then go in and smash his face. That'll teach you. Yeah, I haven't taken any hits yet, which is good. Oh. There we go. I forgot about that. Um, is he gonna do the hand smash thing? Oh, he's gonna do that. Okay. Huh. I almost walked right into that. There we go. Okay, now he's gonna kinda... Ah, uh, you don't want to- No! 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 Let me hit you! Whew! I got him. Okay. Alright. Now he's gonna do this thing again. Okay. Okay. No, okay. They think now he's gonna do the hand clap thing, yeah? Okay. Oh, no, no, no! Okay, I knew I was going to take a hit there. Okay. Okay, okay. Okay. Alright, this should be the last hit. Got him. Oh! Alright. That's what I'm noticing in Mar- uh, At least in this game, the boss battles are actually really short. You just got to have the skill to do it right. But there we go. Our final power moon. Or multi-moon. For the desert. We got two of them. Probably why this place is so big. The hole in the desert. Okay. Alright. Yep, let's get out of here. Alright. And it's morning. Yay! Oh, Phew, it's so hot now, but I do suppose that's what we were trying to accomplish. If we keep up this pace, we'll catch that Bowser in no time. Alright, do we have enough power moons to reach the next kingdom? If you want to check, put me on the globe. Um, so, now the question is, do I want to move on to the next kingdom, or do I want to run around and collect some power moons here? 
Uh, I'm kind of anxious to go check out other things in the ki uh, to, to check out other kingdoms, so I'm probably going to be heading on to the next kingdom. Um, I'm I I think the next kingdom is going to be pretty darn short, so I'll be able to do that really quickly because there's only well yeah there's only okay. one boss battle splendid. It looks as though we've collected enough power Daddy. moves. Um, uh, it says 16 more, but there's enough to make it to the next kingdom. Um, but anyway, I'm just gonna end, whoops, I'm gonna end the episode off here. Um, alright, <laughs> now Mario's dying in the heat. Well, what if I stand in the shade here? Or is it gonna be like super, um, like sunshine, yeah. He's still gonna be dying in the heat. But that's an interesting animation. And, um, Sunshine, he would just wipe his forehead and flick sweat off. But, anyway. <laughs> Alright. Um, let's not leave him dying in the heat for too much longer. So I'm just going to end the episode off here. Um, here's a couple more videos you can check out. Um, yeah, it's de I'm looking at the recording footage. It's definitely not going to be 60 frames. I, I wish I could figure out how to record in 60 frames, but, uh, I don't know how to do that with OBS, but anyway, um, so here's a couple more videos you can check out, um, uh, oh, <laughs> I suppose I could be linking the next episodes, uh, together, um, so the next episode will be here once it is posted, alright, so if you guys like this episode, please leave it a like, and if you would like to see more, please subscribe, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys next time, goodbye!